Sergeant Please. I am Staff Sergeant Vincent of the 3rd Infantry Regiment, United States Army, Commander of the Relief, Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. The ceremony that you are about to witness is the changing of the guard. In keeping with the dignity of this ceremony, it is requested that everyone remain silent and standing. Of the 3,500 recipients of the Medal of Honor, three unknowns lie amongst their ranks. They are honored by millions every year, yet are known but to God. These revered three are the unknown soldiers of World War I, World War II, and Korea. They are guarded at the Tomb of Unknowns in Arlington National Cemetery 24 hours a day, seven days a week, by Sentinels of the Old Guard. When it is time to relieve the Sentinel guarding the tomb, the relief commander conducts a rigorous weapon and uniform inspection of the incoming Sentinel. The standard is perfection. No one is allowed to walk the mat who is not ready of mind, body, and spirit to represent all of us as they guard the unknowns in a vigil that has continued uninterrupted for more than 700,000 hours. Their story begins at the conclusion of World War I. The Great War left an unprecedented number of unknown dead, and America recognized the need to grieve for those whose graves they could never visit. On November 11, 1921, President Warren G. Harding officiated at the interment ceremonies at Arlington National Cemetery. The President conferred upon the unknown soldier the Medal of Honor. The number 21 corresponds to the highest salute accorded to dignitaries in military and state ceremonies. The sentinel crosses the mat in a special measured cadence of exactly 21 steps. The sentinel then faces the tomb for 21 seconds before retracing his steps. On August 3, 1956, President Dwight D. Eisenhower signed a bill to select and pay tribute to the unknowns of World War II and Korea. They were interred in the plaza beside their World War I comrade. Right. President Eisenhower awarded each the Medal of Honor. The sentinel walking the mat does not wear rank insignia, so as not to outrank the unknowns, whatever their ranks may have been.
my dedication to this sacred duty is total and wholehearted. In the responsibility bestowed on me, never will I falter. And with dignity and perseverance, my standard will remain perfection. Through the years of diligence and praise, and the discomfort of the elements, I will walk my tour in humble reverence, to the best of my ability. It is he who commands the respect I protect, his bravery that made us so proud. Surrounded by well-meaning crowds by day, alone in the thoughtful peace of night. This soldier will in honored glory rest under my eternal vigilance.